we're gonna combine the next two. So seven uh, K oh, wow. or under. So so kind of combining. You can't those do that tiers. to him. Sorry, Jeff. Uh, <laughs> a guy you wrote up in your article, uh, David Lipsky, sixty nine hundred. Seven of eight cuts on the season, coming off a T7 finish last week in Punta Cana. Wow. What do we think? He's playing TPC San Antonio for the first time this week. Oh, oh. that's that's spooky. Yeah, it is. I mean, it actually it's a little bit it, it's a little bit spooky. I mean, it's not it's not that big a deal. But Lipsky's played pretty well. He's a solid all around player. Um, I, I think let, let's start with the 7K range because I really like Doug Gamb at 7600. This is a solid young player. He's, he's very, very good ball striker. One thing you really do need to do here, like I mentioned the long iron play, you need to be a solid iron player, especially with those long irons. A lot of longer par threes. Doug Gim brings that. I mean, he, he's very good in proximity just overall. I think he's fifth overall in this field in proximity, but he's good from the longer distances too. And I think Doug Gim is, is the type of player who could pop up here. Like we mentioned this, five of the last 10 winners have been first timers on the PGA Tour. Doug Gim has, has been, you know, he T6 at the, at, the, at the players. I mean, he's coming in with confidence. Like, we've seen this with players in the past, too. Kevin Chappell came up off a of top 10 in 2017 at the Masters to win the Valero. Doug Gim kind of coming off a similar performance. I really like him at 7,600. Down below, you mentioned Lipsky. I think Lipsky is like a safe cash game option. My guy Danny Lee down there at 6,800, I think, is a, is a good GPP option. Going to be very low, and he's played, he's played pretty well. He likes tough courses, too. And then down at 6,300, Brandon Hagee. Is a guy a, a punt play? I don't mind. He he's you know T twenty one at the Valspar again, another tough course. Made the cut last week. Brandon Hagee hits the ball a ton, and uh, he can get hot with the putter. So I like him as a punt play this week. 